Hello everybody, hello, welcome, welcome those on YouTube, welcome those on my um, lovely website, welcome along, we're just going active on Facebook, hopefully we'll be there in just two seconds, um, I'm just waiting for it to appear and say, yes John, you are live, um, so hopefully it'll do that in just a moment, um, if not we're in big trouble, <laughs> um, but no, it's, it'll work, I've got faith in Facebook today. Um, yesterday we did have a little bit of trouble with it, but today, fingers crossed, we're going to be on a roll. Um, I've got a good feeling, I've got a good feeling. So we're just loading up, just give me one second so I can start seeing your comments coming in. And once we see those, then we're, we're on a roll. So I could see somebody is starting to come in. Welcome, folks. Welcome. I can't see your comments just yet because my screen's still loading up. But we are now on Facebook. Hello, Facebook. Way we're here. Hello, and I could see your comments as well. Um, so that's all good. Well, I can't see me. I'm not moving about on the screen, but I could see your comments. So that's... Oh, no, wait. I am moving now. I've got no idea. No idea, but hopefully you guys could see me and that's all that matters. <laughs> If you can see and hear me, let me know. Comment away in the box um, so that I could see what's happening here because for some bizarre and unknown reason, nothing seems to be happening at my side. So I don't even know if you people could hear me or not. So it'd be nice if you could let me know. Um, if you are able to hear and see me, please, if you can. If not, I'll need to refresh again. Do 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 do. Hello Fox, welcome, welcome. I'm going to be doing a little bit of everything. Um, so we're just going to be battering in with it. Let me just get that turned down a wee bit. Right. Yes, could hear me. Brilliant. You could hear me. Excellent. There was me thinking I was going to do Wally and nothing was working. Now, let me just get this screen to come so I could see what is going on. Right. Welcome everybody. I'm a little bit earlier than normal, um, but only because it's teaching day. Um, we're doing teaching today, so I'm a little bit earlier than I normally would be. So just bear with me. We're just getting all set up and all ready. We're just waiting for everybody to come in. So start hitting your share buttons if you're here, folks. Remember, if you want to take part and possibly get a free mini reading, you need to push the share button. Okay. Um, so make sure you're hitting share. Once you hit share, it puts a wee tick beside your name. A wee tick. Imagine that. Um, and it's those little ticks that I look at to see where I'm getting drawn into and who I'm going to go to. Okay. Um, so make sure you're given a little, a little share. Okay. So the rules before we get started are really, 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 really simple. Simple rules. I don't have very many. But there is three of them. They're golden rules. First one is to get a read in, you've got to hit the share button. That's the most important button there, okay, is the share button. That is what can get you your free, media, free read in. Got to keep your little love hearts and your thumbs up scrolling along my screen. So keep punching away on them. Keep tapping, tapping, tapping. Um, and the last rule is once you've shared, start commenting and keep commenting, okay. And be pretty much to the point, be blunt, say exactly what you're wanting. If it's a spirit reading, say who you're wanting to come forward. Um, if it's a psychic reading, so if it's a, is love going to come in, is a new house move coming forward. Be precise, be to the point, just ask for it. If you want a 12 month emotion spread, just say John, 12 months please. That's looking at how you're going to be feeling each day of the month for next year. So through January right through to December. Okay, so let's get looking. Well, you get commenting and sharing and your love hearts and your thumbs. We will see who we're going to go to first. If my little screen's going to allow me to do this. Yes, it is. Good screen. So the first person we're going to go to is Tony Hill. Uh, Tony Hill, let's see. You're wanting a 12-month spread. No problem at all. We'll do a 12-month emotion spread coming your way. Right, let's see. Let's see where we're going to be starting. So, January. January. Ooh. Now, as I'm looking at this card and as we're pulling to January, January is going to be a wondering time for you, okay, Tony? This is going to be you. It's like you're sitting back and you're thinking, right, 
What am I going to do this year? What is going to go on this year? How can I better myself this year? Okay, Tony. So January is going to be very much a wondering month for you. Lots and lots of thinking and planning coming into place. Nothing's getting put in stone. Nothing's moving forward. Um, you're happy, you're settling, you're content. But it's all these thoughts coming in. It's what you're wanting to do, where you're wanting to go, Tony. Uh, next card out, February. As we move into the February time, things start to fall into place, okay? You're starting, the plans that you've been thinking about, these start to get put into motion, okay? And this is when you could say, right, I'm ready to start, okay? This is also a uh, gypsy meaning for the card is a change in work. So there'd be some sort of changes happening work-wise as well in the February time. Pushing into March time, massive changes. Ace of Swords, lovely card. Um, this is changes that... When they come in, you'll be a bit like, oh, I didn't want this. No, this isn't what I'm wanting. But once it starts, there's no stopping you. You really love it. You enjoy it. And again, this is going into a work vibration, but everything else in between. April time, if you're not in a relationship, there's a relationship coming forward to you. If you are in a relationship, watch for the communication and the feeling between the two of you. It's just been a lot more solid, okay? There's just this real nice vibration coming in together and really blending better. May time, again, there's this light bulb moment and I feel this is sort of to do with, this is to do with things you're wanting to say. There's things at this minute in time, things you're wanting to do, things you're wanting to say and it's saying in the May time you get that chance to say it. It's like everything comes flowing off your tongue. June time, watch your pennies a wee bit. I don't want to be spending money on anything that I don't really need. Okay, this is saying watch your pennies. It's also planning a holiday. So, you start getting things thinking and you start planning ahead, okay? Moving into the July time, this is your hopes and dreams coming forward to you. This is a great month. This is a real month where you're feeling yourself, okay? Big, big month for you. August time, that feeling continues on. These dreams keep coming forward. Things are really moving for you. You've got this bounce back in your step. Your shoulders are back. September time, now you could ease up with those money troubles that you've been having, okay? You could start spending a little more. This is also saying financially you're going to be in a better place and again it's that change because it's a change within yourself it's making you feel better because you've got that money around you october a lot of decisions come forward to you there's a change and i feel this is sort of more what you're wanting okay this is like two paths being laid in front of you you've got a big choice to make here um, November time, those choices, whatever way you go, it doesn't matter because November time is going to be an absolute hoot, okay? Loads and loads of smiles, loads and loads of laughter coming in there. December time, you're just on, you're amazing. You're on cloud nine. You've got a really nice year there coming in. There's nothing really I would be worried about. Just the June month, watch what you're doing in June. Don't be spending too much, okay? And it's because of the new opportunities that come forward to you in the July time. You need to keep it all behind for that. Okay, thank you very much. Take care. Um, Gillian Vulke, I'm going to come to yourself, Gillian Vulke. How's my nan, please? Right, let's get connected into you and let's see who's coming forward. Um, do you know, Gillian, straight away as I'm pulling into your vibration there, I'm very much aware of a lady stepping forward here and I do feel this has got that granny vibration as I'm pulling into her. About five foot six as she's stepping forward here. I do get a shortness of breath as I'm pulling into her, so I feel there's a problem in her sort of chest and her lung area here as she's coming forward. I also feel as well she's got problems with her back. She's also not very good on her legs, okay? A very independent woman, but a woman full of smiles, you know, I feel she would do anything she can to sort of help people as I'm pulled forward to her here. She wants to connect the April month with her, so either her birthday or passing or something special happened to her, but the April month would connect to this lady in some way. I feel she's in and around you at this time because there's a situation happening where you're needing to speak up for yourself, you're needing to say what's on your mind, and it's like she's coming in because when she was here she always found the right word, she knew how to say things, she knew how to get things forward, and she's bringing that in to say, Come on, we need to get something said. Okay, take the ladies' love and I'll say thank you very much. Mwah. So folks, welcome along if you've just joined me. Make sure you're hitting your share button. Once you hit your share button, it puts a wee tick beside your name. And once you've got a tick beside your name, I'm then able to connect into your vibration. Keeping your love hearts and your thumbs scrolling my screen because they're beautiful and I love it. Uh, so keep them going. Remember, if you want a reading, be to the point, be precise, say exactly who you're wanting to come through um, or what you kind of reading you're wanting and I'll do my best to do it for you. 
Right, let's see, where are we going to go next? Um, Charlene Quinn. Charlene Quinn, I'm going to come to yourself. I would love for a message from my uncle if there's anything, please. Let's have a wee look, Charlene. Let's see who we've got here. Uh, Tony, you're very, very welcome. Mwah. Right, do you know Charlene is, I'm connecting into you. I'm very aware of a gentleman stepping forward here actually and he does give me that uncle vibration. Now this is bizarre, normally you ask for someone and we don't get them, we get somebody else. But I do feel this is this uncle vibration that you're talking of that's coming in here. About five, five, nine, five, ten in height as he comes in, quite a stocky built gentleman. Shoulders are pushed right back, heads held high, a very proud gentleman as he comes in here. Want to connect the June month with him, so either his birthday's passing or something special happened to him. But the June month would connect to here. Do you feel he likes to have a wee drink as well? He loves socialising as I'm pulled in. Um, he wants to connect with five, so I feel there's five in his family or he's got five kids, something, but five would have to connect with a gentleman in some way here. I feel his passing was very, very quick. It's like he was here one minute and he was in the spirit world the next minute. Um, this is a very hard working gentleman. Nothing ever fell on his lap as he's coming forward here. I feel he wants to talk about his car. He must have been proud of his car or something, but he's talking about a car as he's coming in here. No idea what he wants to say about it. It, but he's talking about the car as it comes forward here but he wants to talk about you there's things there's things needing done in your home at this moment in time okay and I'm wanting to go into your living room here I just feel that I'm wanting a change in it and it's like you've been wanting this for a while and this gentleman saying come on can we get it done because it's frustrating him as much as it is you a lovely lovely vibration from this gentleman as I'm pulling into him and I just feel where he's wanting to send a lot of love forward to you at this moment in time okay take this gentleman's love and I'll say thank you very much take care bye bye right let's see where are we going to go next um, Suzanne Breen, 12 month, kiss, Mwah, a kiss for you, right Suzanne, let's have a wee look, let's see where we're going, hello everybody that's just joined in, keep sharing, hit your share button, um, invite all your friends, you never know, might have a, a wee message for one of your friends or family, so make sure you hit your share button, that's also what lets you be able to get a reading. Once you've hit your share, you get a tick beside your name. So share, share, share. Uh, keep your comments straight and to the point as well. Right, let's see. This is the 12th month for yourself. Um, January time. Oh, January. Know what we're wanting in January, but it is that typical January feeling, okay? This is you counting the pennies, all right? This is you wondering how the heck are we going to get through January, okay? This is a worrying time for you. But this card also means it's not going to be long lasting, okay? So although, yes, it's no very nice when you're in it and you're in January, it's saying try and keep your head up, keep looking forward because things are going to get better. And there it comes, right into the February month. Things start to pick up for you, okay? Things start to change. There's sudden changes coming forward to you here as we're pulling in. You start getting that bounce back in your step. Pushing into the March time, if you're not in a relationship, there's one coming in. If you are in a relationship, then this is saying... Things are getting spicy, going to be getting jiggy. A lovely, lovely month, and it's the follow through from February, so that feeling continues through into that March time. Push it into April time, light bulb moment. This is you getting an idea. This is you saying, hmm. What do I want to do? That's what I want to do. Something comes in. This is to do with work. You're wanting something different regarding your work life here. And it, like, it comes in, bang, like that into your mind. And it gets you excited here, okay? It's not going to pull off in that month, but the ideas come and you start pushing forward with it. May time, however, you start to... St Excuse me. You start to push forward with these plans a bit more, okay? Also talk of a holiday coming in in the May month. June month, I do see you going away for a couple of days. There's a couple of days coming in here. The plans that you've been thinking about in April, they're coming into action now, okay? These, this work condition, this is when change comes forward in that June month. Pushing into July time, do you know what? This is a lovely family time for you. There's loads of people around you. You're on top of the world. You're feeling a lot more better within yourself. And you just feel like all of these different parts of your life it's all starting to fall into place here it's also the luck card you know you haven't had very much of it this year you were expecting bigger things it never happened this is saying come the july time you know those things are in place they're in there come august time this is when we're going away okay so we're away on a wee holiday you've got your feet up you've got a relaxed feeling you're feeling really really good about yourself oh the ten of pentacles it continues over there this is sort of house is doing great work's doing great love life's on the up um 
you yourself are in a much better place. So this is saying fantastic. Gee whiz, pushing into October, we're carrying on that great feeling. Uh, November time, yeah, yeah. lock yourself in the house and then you go out, sweetheart. Okay, this is saying you're kind of doubting everything. Because things have been going so well for so long, you're sort of pulling into yourself, you're blocking people out, you're shutting yourself down and returning to old ways. Don't allow this to happen. This is a warning saying don't let this happen. So when November comes the next year, make sure you don't fall into that. As December comes in, though, you know, I'm really saying to you, you're picking it back up. You're getting it back in there. You're enjoying things again. And we're shooting back up to the way you were feeling in that September month. Lovely, lovely year. Only time I want to say watch out is November. That's when you need to pay attention to what's going on round about you. Okay. Take care. Love and light. Right, let's see, where are we going to go next? Where are we going to go next? Linda Leach would love a message from my son, mum or any family member. Okay, Linda, let's have a wee look. Let's see where we're going to go for you. Folks, remember, keep hitting your share button. It's the way you can get selected to get your free mini reading. Okay, share, keep commenting. I only see so many comments at a time, so you need to keep commenting because yours disappears. I only see four or five of them and then it knocks down, so just keep coming. I don't think you're being rude, just keep them coming, all right? Linda, straight away as I'm talking there, I'm very much aware of a lady coming forward here, and as this lady vibration steps in, she'd be about five foot six as she's stepping forward here. She's quite a nice, nice rounded lady as she's coming in here, okay? Quite short hair as she's stepping forward. Um, really nice sense of humour as she's coming in here as well. She's got that wee cheeky side to her, but she's also got that nature where one minute she could be really nice, then she could be like, bang! like a tiger okay she would give it her all here sometimes head and mouth aren't in sync so you know sometimes things just sort of came out she didn't really mean to say it the way she did but she always had the beliefs that she should just say it when it comes into her mind here okay I also feel with this lady she wants to connect the um, August month so either her birthday or passing or something very special happened to her but August with, would connect to this lady in some way she does make me aware of two children in the spirit world so there's two family babies coming forward here when I get children it's always to go in your home and it's not that it's a sad place it's just needing that bit of energy that pick me up to come in there and lift it lift it back up there I also feel there's somebody else in the spirit world another lady and I feel I would have had a stroke with this lady I'm not saying she passed with a stroke but I feel she would have had a stroke I actually feel when she passed it would have been her heart that took her over okay because she's just aching in at the heart here um, there is also a dog that comes in here. Now, I do have sort of collie sized dogs that's stepping forward. A lovely, lovely dog that's coming in here. Dogs are always for strength, so I know you're getting that bit of strength at this moment in time. Lots and lots of love coming in from the spirit world for you. And they're saying keep your head up, okay? Keep your head up and keep pushing forward. Take care. Love and light, Linda. Right, uh, Jennifer Somerville. 12 month spread, please. Mwah. Kiss. Kiss back to you. Let's do a 12 month for you. Let me just get these cards shuffled up. Uh, I think they're needing a good shuffle. So folks, while I'm shuffling these, make sure you're hitting your share button, keeping your love hearts and your thumbs up scrolling my screen, because I do like them. Um, also, see if you get a reading, folks. If you get a reading, um, and it was good. Even if you didn't get a reading and you just enjoyed watching, make sure you post a visitor's comment on my wall. All right, because it's nice to read your comments at times. I like that. Woo! Oh, oh, Jennifer, you'll need to wait. I'm throwing cards on the flare. Pod the boat, Jennifer Somerville. Right, are we ready, Jennifer? Let's see what's going on. So this is an emotion spread, how you're going to be feeling each day, each month next year. Okay, so pushing into January. Good, you've got the same as the last person for January, okay? This is saying <laughs> we've all we all go through it in January. This is the wonder. Where the heck's the money coming from? How am I going to pay the bills this month? When's payday? When's this? Money is very, very tight, okay? Now, it's this card is saying it does sort of pull you down a wee bit. It makes you crawl into yourself. It makes you sort of, you know, hide away in the corner and be like, ah, oh, I just want to lock myself up here. All right. How, oh, Queen of Pentacles. Just what you're wanting to push forward into February there, okay? This is saying things will start to change, okay? There's that nice 
feeling where yes, the wages come in, you're feeling a lot better, you've got that bounce coming back into your step, your energy is a lot more lifted, absolutely lovely time as we go into there. Pushing into March time it continues but there'll be a slight change coming in, I feel you're wanting a different sort of, this is, feels to me like a different work energy, okay, so it's a different vibration with work as I'm connecting into this. Um, this is you apply in, sending out application forms. It's not the job coming in, but it's the applications going out. It's the stuff being done for it. Pushing into April, however, I want you to watch out for things coming back. I feel there's interviews coming in there, but I also feel something comes off near the end of the month where, yes, I got the job, okay? This is also a lovely month. This is a month, Gypsy meaning for the card is, um, start preparing okay and it's preparing for moving forward because you're about to go from feeling a bit flat to being on cloud nine okay pushing into the may type May time, you you know what, it's like you've got this new job, you've got the fresh new money coming in, you're in a better place and you want to squander it all, okay? This is saying hold tight, don't rush into anything to you. That decoration in the house, the new furniture that you want, the new perfume you're wanting, hold on, don't do it just yet, okay? This is a month of trying to hold back and I feel as I'm pulled in here, you know the type of person, you know, you're a bit like me, patience, none, all right? Uh, June time as we're coming in, yes, success is coming forward, job's going good. Great. the new job's going great now we could ease up on these things you're wanting to do this is saying now we could start pushing forward with it moving into the july time again that lovely feeling coming forward there would be a holiday in the july time as well august time just the same lovely lovely feeling coming in there september time however you start to get choices coming forward to you okay now this is will i won't i choices that come forward this is different paths that you can go down this is saying think about it carefully don't rush when you just decision when this choice comes forward to you. Um, oh, October time. If you're not in a relationship, you will be in October and this will be a very, very juicy relationship. If you are in a relationship, this is it getting juicy. If there's no ring on the finger, it's coming in on the finger. Okay, if there's already a ring on the finger, you're about to get some spice brought in for all the right reasons. Um, November time is new beginnings start, and this is you planning ahead. It's like you're saying to yourself, right, I need to get ready for the next year. Okay, and that's what you're doing. You're getting things in place so that you're not in that same difficult January place that you were that year. Okay, um, December comes along, just lovely, lovely smiles, you know what, just enjoy it, absolutely enjoy it. I don't see anything awful coming in there, apart from the May time, just hold back, make no big decisions, um, that's the only one there, okay. Oh, sorry, in September, September time, don't be making that choice spur of the moment, think about it before you push forward with it, okay, take care. Um, Kells more oh god it's just disappeared let me try and find that again dee, 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 dee. where is it Kells Moran um gran or granda please John and a kiss Mwah! I love your kisses hello everybody that's just joined in hello welcome make sure you're hitting your share button share 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 puts a tick beside your name meaning you're able to get a read in so make sure you're doing that um, and then get commenting comment like mad keep your love hearts and your thumbs on the screen they're disappearing keep them there right Kells you know what as I'm pulling into your vibration here I feel I've got a gentleman coming forward this gentleman would be about five foot eight as he's stepping forward here <laughs> he's telling me I'm, I hate being stuck in the house son can I get outside he wants to go and stand outside you know I feel he enjoyed being either in his garden and allotment or just outside in general here as he's coming in and um, I do feel that he would have passed in hospital conditions as he's stepping forward here and I do feel it would have been a very very um smooth passing okay it's like he closed his eyes and he just went over to the spirit world as he's coming Coming in here he is telling me there was a lot of conditions with himself as he's pulling in so I feel there was a lot of things um, a matter with the gentleman's body as he's coming in here he's he, he likes a good wee drink he's telling me he's not a big talker okay he's not a big talker at all in the slightest but he's somebody that was always listening a little bit hard to hear as I'm connecting into him but he always listened he paid attention to what was going on 
in conversations, okay? Um, he does want to wish a happy birthday, so there's a birthday that's just been or just coming up, but he wants to wish a birthday, um, a happy birthday. He also wants to connect the September month with him, so either his birthday is passing or something special happened to him, but September would mean something. He's got a pair of glasses on, but he wants to put them across onto yourself. Now, I don't know if you wear glasses or you've meant to, but he wants to put glasses onto you so that you could see things a bit more clearly, okay? Um, please take the gentleman's love, and I'll say thank you very much. Take care. Right, where are we going now? Louise Burry, Louise Burry, a 12 month spread please. Certainly Louise will do a 12 month spread for you sweetheart. Um, this is a 12 month emotion spread folks, so it says exactly how you're feeling each month. If you've got anything you need to look out for, or if you've got nothing to look out for. Either way, you're going to know about it. Okay, so here we go. Just getting these shuffled up. Just sometimes my guide always tells me when to stop, and sometimes he has me shuffling for blooming ages. So keep sharing, folks. Keep commenting, and keep your love hearts and your thumbs coming. Uh, it's really nice. Right, so straight away. Oh, lovely. Okay, as we move into January, you've got the opposite of everybody else, okay? You've got that happy, but you've still got the Christmas feeling around you as I'm in January. You know, you're still buzzing, you're really happy, outgoing. You've watched what you've been doing sort of around about December time, so you're not in that panic mode. We're going, oh no, where's the money coming from? You've got this real nice energy about you, okay? Um, lovely, lovely time in January for you. Now, as we move into February, that continues, that pulls forward here. I'm still seeing that calmness come in, but watch for situations in work, okay? I'm just feeling this real cloud coming over and this bitchy feeling in the workplace. So I want you to watch for that as I'm pulling in there. Um, however, moving into March time, it really does subside, okay? It's like you don't take part in it. It subsides, it's fine. This is the happy card. This is the card saying everything's at your doorstep. Everything's sitting there. We're about to make changes. So the universe is saying we're about to bring lovely things in for you for this year. April time as we're pulling in here, there is... Um, do you know what? This is, if you're not in a relationship, this is a, a new relationship coming forward. If you are in a relationship at this moment in time, make sure you pay attention to each other, okay? This is a time of watch because if we're not paying attention it's like things could go wrong, all right? So make sure you are paying attention and still communicating. But if you're not in a relationship, this is something coming forward. I don't feel it's going to be a long, long-term relationship, but it's that nice, that nice small relationship that comes in. It's like it gives you that energy to push forward, okay? Moving into May time, there's a lot of strength coming into you, okay? I'm feeling you're getting your power back. You're getting that bounce back in your step. You're getting that energy feeling coming in there. Um, pushing into the June time, that feeling can continues, you're absolutely amazing, you're on cloud nine. Moving into July, there's house improvements being done here, so we're decorating, changing the furniture, it's all going the house as we're moving into the July time. August as we come in, in, out in August time, I want you to watch people round about you, there's a lot of jealousy going to be stepping forward here, and it's not you, this is other people jealous of you and what you've sort of been achieving this year, okay? Don't fall for it, don't bite back, just stay calm, keep quiet and push forward. September time, you start sort of looking back on old memories, you're revisiting the past there. This card's saying, yes, revisit the past, but don't keep yourself in it too long, okay? Keeping yourself in it too long could pull you down, so make sure you're just thinking about it, you giggle, you're laughing, and you bring yourself back up and look forward to your October time. This is all your dreams coming true, sweetheart, okay? Um... This is everything falling into place. This is the family card. It's the celebration card as well. So there'll be celebrations in o October time. November time, you're on absolute flying, okay? Um, in December, you're the exact same, okay? So lovely end to the, to the year next year. October, November, uh, December are amazing times for you feeling great achievements and great things with you. Take care. Okay. Right, let's see who are we going to go to next. I feel a lot of tea today. 